Okay, check this out. A group of bakers from Phoenix recently won the national, national gingerbread house competition. And check out their concoction right there. Now you know why, right? It's the second year in a row this winning, they won the grand prize. And as Kim Powell tells us, their winning creation is something that takes months, months to make. The Merry Mischief Bakers from downtown Phoenix did it again after loads of sugar and fondant, lots and lots of gingerbread, and 2,000 hours on the project. This is their grand prize winning gingerbread house. So our story is that this is Santa's carousel and the elves are playing on it on Christmas Day because all their toys have been delivered. And the carousel celebrates the seven continents of the world where the toys are delivered, so the animals represent the various continents of the world. Ted Scooty and Adam Starkey put their wedding cake business on the back burner during the pandemic and shifted their focus on gingerbread to enter the national competition held every year in Asheville, North Carolina. And to be honest, competition's fun because there isn't a client. We get to do whatever we want. Now they've added other team members, each with a different task. So you bake the gingerbread cookies, take the sandpaper and sand it down into flour. I send it back to him. He makes some sort of ginger clay, like Play-Doh, and I mold uh, all the floorboards. Each sugar artist comes to the table several months ahead of the holiday season to come up with ideas. And throughout the year, it's perfected. And it's very different from the gingerbread houses you may make as a yeah. child. Their apartment has turned into their makeshift bakery to make those extravagant gingerbread houses. They have everything they need in here, including sugar and even power tools. For example, to get this 22.5 degree angle at the top, all of the supports inside had to be sanded very particularly. The hardest part, they say, is getting the finished product across the country. But because of the travel, uh, one of the challenges, we have to like design it to break it apart so it can travel in pieces. So for example, this traveled in one box, this traveled in another, and the base was actually checked. A dash of sugar and spice, and a whole lot of determination. The Merry Mischief Bakers are now cooking up ideas for next year's gingerbread house. Kim Powell for Arizona's Family.